What up everyone and welcome to Tijuana, Mexico. I made it, crossed my foot today. I parked my car by a relative's house. Then I took the trolley over to the border, which is $2.50 American. Um, it was like a five minute uh, trolley ride here. Crossed my foot in like less than two minutes. It was very quick. Um, so I made it here, got my hotel behind me. Um, looks like it's actually gonna be a really great spot. There's literally everything that happens right here in Centro Tijuana is right here on this street. So I'm actually gonna really enjoy it. I can go out, enjoy myself, have some drinks, not have to worry about driving anywhere or anything like that. So um, it was really cheap too, it was $52 a night for this room. So uh, plenty more footage to come. Uh, just stay tuned, please like and subscribe. So everyone, I just want to give a quick update. So um, I got to Tijuana, checked into my hotel room, been walking around this uh, Centro area. I uh, got a haircut, got some tacos, and got a bottled beer. And I've still spent just under 20 American dollars. So it's a lot cheaper out here. Um, so I really like it. As you can see, there's a ton going on out here. Um, this is the main street, it's popping right now. And it's still daytime, so you can imagine at nighttime how it gets. Uh, some of my previous videos, you can see how how it gets at nighttime. Um, this is a Sunday, so it's not that bad. But it's still a lot of fun. I'm having a blast. Hope you're enjoying.
All right, so it's just about midnight here in Tijuana, my first night here of this trip. Um, I gotta say, I'm really impressed with Hotel Rio Rita um, in Tijuana, Zona Centro Tijuana. Um, honestly, it's probably my favorite layout and my favorite hotel so far that I've um, kind of given a tour of on this channel. It's just so unique. The location of it is so cool. Um, each floor has its own little like balcony type thing. And then each floor also has its own lounges. So it's really, really unique. Um, let me walk over to the other side right when you get off the elevator. But it's really cool. It's a great theme. It is an adult only hotel. So they don't allow kids here. So just a heads up. Um, it's not a big deal for me, but for some of you, I'm, under, I'm sure it may be. But yeah, it's really cool. The theme's amazing. The rooms are really brand new, practically. And here's another theme I'm talking about. So that's kind of the first thing you see right when you get off the elevator. So, um, and like I said, every floor has its own um, like lobby slash balcony slash theme. So um, I like it. Like I said, it's probably my favorite so far. Um, just a heads up, it is adult only. And um, they make you sign some rules. I don't know how strict they are with adhering to those rules, but um, they did say no alcohol, no guest. Um, again, I don't know how strict they are, but when you go up the stairs, they do have a, an employee that's at the front desk. So you pretty much have to pass the employee on the way up. Um, you know, I brought up like a Gatorade and some hot dogs right now, and she didn't really seem to care what was in my bag, but so I don't know how strict they'd be about alcohol, but just again, those are rules that they did. Overall though, I'm really impressed with it. Like I said, the rooms were, the rooms are practically, they look brand new. You have a mini fridge, you have one of the ceiling shower things that, I, that I'm in love with. So overall, A plus for this um, hotel, I love it. Um, and it's been the cheapest that I've had so far out here. So yeah, um, I'll show some more footage in the morning, but yeah, for tonight, that's it.